Hi guys, this is Megan with the blog WilsonHomestead.com and today I wanted to do a unboxing and review of the Irie bras. These are hand dyed, hand sewn bras that are made right here in the USA. I've been on the hunt for some more sustainably made bras to kind of change up my collection now that some of my older bras are getting more worn out. I actually hadn't brought, bought bras for like five years and especially with new baby coming and more breastfeeding I was just really feeling like I need some more I need some new bras I need some I want some nice bras I want ones that are gonna be healthy on my skin and not be putting more toxins on my breasts I do not like wire bras they're really not good for your breasts either I wanted something that was a bit more relaxed not so tight but something that made me feel like it was relaxed and loose but not like you know stuff was hanging out. So that's when I discovered the Irie collection. I had kept seeing these on Instagram. One of my favorite Instagram accounts, I will link her down below, Wild Flora Wellness. She kept sharing about these bras and they also sell underwear, but today I'm just reviewing the bras because these are the ones, the bras are the ones I've used the longest. And so I started looking more into the company and they are based out of California. It is a small mama owned company and she hires only a few people to do like sewing she does all the dyeing herself i think like it's just a really cool situation a really little company which i love to support if i can they also find sustainably sourced fabrics and they use a lot of like plants and foods and different things to dye their fabrics which is really cool so everything i was seeing about their company and all of that was lining up with what i was looking for in a bra and so I went ahead and decided to try some. I ordered three the first time and she was sweet enough to send me another one for free. It was another style. So I started out with four different styles. Since then I've actually gotten one more bra. It's the same as one of these. It's just the next size up. So I've had, I have five bras that I've been wearing for a bit. I've been washing them and using them. So I have a pretty good idea at this point of how much I like them and if I recommend them or not. So hopefully you guys find this video helpful and I hope this gives you a good idea of if you want to try these yourself and I'm hoping to get more small companies out there to you guys of more sustainably sourced clothing options and just all that different stuff. So I'd like to start doing more of these videos so if you like this video let me know. But let's get right into this. The bras I picked off their website were the Bear Bra, Reversible Twist, the Classic Bra, and then the one she sent me was the Triangle Bra. And then the one I bought again after that was the Classic Bra, but in the extended size. So because they're such a small company, they just do really small batches of these bras. So they'll do drops and they won't always have all of the styles. They'll always have different colors. A lot of their colors are really cool, like almost tie-dye looking. But also because of that, they sell out really fast. I'm talking like within an hour. <laughs> so you gotta follow them on Instagram if you're wanting to get a bra because they always share when they're going to do their next drops. I always put it, if I'm wanting to get something from them, I'll put it on my phone calendar with a reminder because as soon as the stuff drops, you're gonna wanna pick out what you want and order it. There's certain ones like I still want to try the plunge bra and every time I've tried to order that one it sells out within minutes. That one is really hard to get so you have to be really ready. I will usually have my credit card and whatever I need there right away so I can just go ahead and order as fast as possible. So clearly you can see since there's such a demand for these bras people really like them. It's just a little frustrating when you can't get the bra you want because everyone's buying it. So, but shockingly, the first order I did when I got those first four bras, I was able to get every bra that I wanted. So every bra I put in the cart, I ended up with, the second time I ordered, I tried to order the extended size and a plunge bra, and the plunge bra sold out before I could get through the checkout. So, I was completely shocked that that first time I was able to get four bras at once it was pretty crazy and I was so so excited to get them in the mail again it's been over five years since I bought a new bra so I was very excited to get them in the mail and try them out try them all on see how I liked them they were in the cutest packaging they were wrapped in tissue paper with the iRe collection sticker on the front and they were wrapped with twine when you do your first order you can have them either send you 
wash instructions or not if you're a repeat customer. So if you hit that option, it'll have a little greenish colored card that has all the wash instructions. It'll have your invoice. And then obviously you can see as I'm unboxing these bras, they are just gorgeous colors. They're such unique styles. I am just so excited to try them on. So here is the classic bra. It's just a really basic kind of sports bra style. It's really relaxed. I feel like I could wear this with jeans or under overalls or something and it would be fine because it's just, it's, it has a lot of coverage. I feel like it's more of a lounge top even than a regular bra. The next one is the reversible twist. So you can see this is twisted right here and it's gonna be worn either way. So this twist can be in the front or it can be in the back and this can be the front. Personally right now, while I'm pregnant, probably while I'm breastfeeding and I have a little bit more cleavage than normal, I prefer to wear the twist in the back, actually. I thought I would prefer to wear it in the front, but it's just, it doesn't quite feel like enough coverage. But I know when I'm done breastfeeding and my breasts go back down to pretty small, I will probably prefer to have the twist in the front. It's gonna just depend on my when I'm breastfeeding or not. But look at the beautiful colors in this one and all the variation in it. It's just really, really gorgeous. This next one is the bear bra. Out of all of them, this is definitely the most revealing one, as you can probably tell from the name. Let me try to get these straps straightened out. So here's the front. front there and then here's the back and it crosses in the back so this one is really attractive it fits me really well again I feel like it'll fit me even better after I'm done breastfeeding but even while I am breastfeeding I feel like I'll like this one because it doesn't come up so high it's like almost right right here and right here I feel like I could pull it aside really easily to breastfeed in this so I, I have a feeling I'll like this one a lot for breastfeeding and then even afterwards when my breasts are smaller. And then here is the triangle bra. It's just really basic. It comes up higher in the back than the other ones. But I feel like out of all of them, this one fits me the best. This has become my favorite. I, when I first order them, ordered them, I felt like the reversible twist would be my favorite, but this one just, it fits me so perfectly. The V comes down in just the perfect spot and it, it just, it really works well. And it's also gonna be a great one to breastfeeding because these just cross in the front so you can pull them aside. They don't have these as often as some of the other ones. It seems like they have the classic bras almost every time and some of those other styles. They haven't actually dropped these since I've been buying bras from them. This was one that she just sent me out of her personal stash. So I was very thankful to have been able to try this before they even dropped any since I've been buying. This is one but I want another bra or two in this style because it's that good. It's, it's gonna be that nice for breastfeeding and it also has enough coverage that I don't feel uncomfortable just walking around the house in it. And then here's the last bra. This is the classic bra, but it's in the extended size. So all those other four bras are just the regular size. They fit small, medium, and large. And then the extended size fits the three above large, I think. I wanted to try this though, just to see how much looser it was. And also just for, it's a little bit bigger, a little more coverage, just for wearing more as like a yoga top, I felt like would be really nice. Because the, the other classic bra that I got first felt pretty tight at the beginning. It's loosened up more as I've worn it, they get softer and stretchier. So I didn't feel like I really even really needed to get this one, but it was still fun to try. And I like that it's a little bit bigger for you know yoga and different things. Now, the one thing I will say, because this is a totally honest review, is that when I first started wearing the classic bra, it would ride up. It would start coming up and I'd keep having to pull it down over my boobs. <laughs> and it was actually getting really annoying. I washed it and then I wore it again and it stopped doing it. And it seems like every time I wash it, and as I'm wearing it more, it does it less. It's like the fabric is just getting more fitted to my body or something. But that problem has been resolved. So I just wanted to mention that in case you try this and you experience that, try washing it a couple times just to see if it loosens it up enough to make it more comfortable because that worked perfectly well for me. And now it's my favorite besides the triangle bra and it just fits really well. So I don't know why it did that, but 
I just thought I would throw it out there because I wanted to mention everything that I experienced with these bras. So they're made out of a mixture of cotton and spandex and they are sewn in a double layer so you can see so here's the front and this is a double layer so you can actually even get in between the layers of this bra. It goes all the way through which is kind of cool. I just like you know it goes all the way through. It is sewn on the side so it's not like going to come detached but I just really like how that looks because you can kind of see both edges while you're wearing it and it just looks really cool. The fabric feels really high quality and like they're going to last a long time. And again, as I'm washing them more, the fabric is getting softer and stretchier. So do I recommend them? Absolutely. I almost don't want to recommend them because more people will go buy them before I can. <laughs> but yes, I do highly recommend them. I've had a really good experience with them so far. And I love that the company is small enough that you can actually contact the owner directly on Instagram if you have any questions. And she's just been really nice to deal with. I'm also going to be trying out their underwear next. So I'll probably be having a review coming up of their underwear that may be after baby's born. We'll see how it goes. And I'm really excited to try those. But overall, I am very happy with all these bras. I love the fabric. I love that they're hand dyed. They look so pretty and unique. I love that the just the style of how they're sewn is just so different than any other bras you can find out there like really they're just they're pretty cool so i'm definitely hooked they're a little bit addictive it's hard not to buy bras whenever they have a drop so i will make sure to link the their instagram and their website so you guys can go find some yourself i'll also link my blog post where i wrote out this review and if you have anything else you guys want me to review or try any other sustainable or organic clothing brands please let me know and i would be happy to look into them but thank you for watching this video and i'll see you next time bye